What up, guys? I have cha- I have <laughs> I have channel. <laughs> I have. I have channel, channel in my shan today. Mm. It's good to be with you, bro. Man, it's good to be here. So that's a nice guitar. What Thanks. do you got this over is there? A, this it's is a, a Klaus Apollo. Klaus Apollo. Oh, yeah. oh wow! Yeah. I love I love the blue carbon fiber. That's why I thought it popped. I thought it popped a little bit, you know, trying to match the Carbon fiber? Here. Yeah, right? Uh. Oh, wow, it matches my knife. Oh, my gosh, look, look at, at this. That. Look wow. At that. Wow, look at that. How, look, can you put your guitar right there? That's crazy. It's like made for each other. Wow, how about that? We didn't even, none of this was even planned. We didn't planned. plan that. Wow. Didn't plan so we just shot a video for his channel. You got to check that out yes. after you watch, you're done watching this. Mm -hmm. I've been posting some of the covers, rock Guitar rock covers on my channel. You play a great a live Spanish show. Spanish guitar. Okay. And it's a lot of fun. Anyone can do this. Let's do it. Can I hear that song, Iron Man, on an electric guitar, like the way it usually sounds? Usually they play like power chords, like. <laughs> like that's, you know, that's kind of like the traditional way yeah. you'd hear it. Exactly. Right? Yeah. And you, you will be like, oh, there's no way you can turn into into uh, Spanish guitar. Yes, yes. You can turn any anything. song can if you, be. If you imagine hard enough, you can do anything that you want. And it's fun. It's a lot of fun, especially when you have a looper. If you don't have a looper, you can still jam with a with a friend of yours, mm -hmm. especially with a guitar like this. This is a Cordoba or G. Cordoba in K. Spanish. You have to say Cordoba. Correctly. What is it called? Cordoba. GK Studio. GK um, Studio that yeah. they sent uh, Sweetwater sent this to Sean. Mm -hmm. And, uh, so why don't I grab the other one? So we'll be get the nylon other one on nylon to transform the song. Yes, into a Spanish guitar song. Basically, you have to figure out what chords. Mm -hmm. What chords are there when we play this? I'm hearing an E minor. Yep, that's what I'm hearing. Mm -hmm. So you don't have to switch every single time to yeah. other chord. You could stay on the E minor. Yeah. But you can also go through the G if you want. So mm -hmm. let's do it with the G. Okay. You don't have to stay longer on G either. You can no. just go directly to the this is transition. E minor. Because so. that's where in the array, the riff. Exactly. You end up there, exactly. You know, so. so you can just go. It's up to you. There it it's is. It's up to you. But basically. Hearing a C there. Okay, okay. Let's play a C. Okay. And then, and then back to A minor. All right, so you play. simple we did that mm -hmm. we just use the chords similar to a rumba rhythm so what technically is a rumba rhythm can you uh, explain it's that? just a kind of rhythm flamenco guitar has a lot of different rhythms one of them bulerias uh, sevillana and by the way i am not a flamenco player <laughs> i am i am not trained in flamenco just in case you're wondering, hey, hey, he doesn't even sound like him. he's from Spain. I'm not from Spain, I'm Mexican. <laughs> but I love the Spanish guitar, especially rumba, which is a very popular kind of, it's like the pop of flamenco. Okay. It's All very right. popular. Interesting. And easy, easier than other rhythms. It's Which is kind of like a rock beat. When you think about like, Basically. A, like a kick to snare. Yeah, because it's kick, one, kick, two, kick, three, snare, four, right? one, two. No. Look at this, bulerias in the other hand mm -hmm. is 12 beats. Really? How ridiculous. Uh, and you go, uno, dos, uno, dos, tres. And the accents are like in random places. Check this out. Uno, dos, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez. Uno, dos, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho. Uh, rumba is more relatable to other cultures. I okay. think that's why it's so popular. Because it's one, two, three, four. And I think we have a video on how to play rumba, so yeah, I don't have uh -huh. to like teach it now, but... It's good to know though, you know? Okay, so... So when you hit it, that's where the snare would be in a rock song, right? 
Pretty much. So that's how you can kind of like, it's not that hard to take a rock song and make it like a group of Spanish. I don't know if it's necessarily where the, where the snare goes. I guess you're right. Yeah. Don't, yeah. You're right again, man. Always, always. Don't don't come at me. <laughs> you're right yeah. again. Uh -huh. So yeah, so that's how we transform that song. All you have to do is play the melody on your on your Cor Cordoba GK studio. <laughs> no, G you say GK? Yeah, yeah. G for Gypsy Kings. That's what GK. Oh, is. this yeah. is a Gypsy King guitar. Yeah. Uh huh. Ole. Oh. <laughs> and so you just have to play the melody. But in the jamming part, that's when you use the scale that I, that we just talked about on his video, mm -hmm. which is the like the harmonic minor for gene dominant. Free gene dominant. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. And so basically, look, play the same chords. So let's say I already played the melody, right? Now I want to jam. What did I do? Well, I just played a scale that uses a lot of the G sharp, we spoke about it in the video, mm -hmm. G sharp, and it uses a D, a D sharp. Yeah. And um, basically, that's it. You um, said G sharp and D sharp to your C major yeah, and minor scale. Pretty much. And, and, and then it sounds like Spanish guitar. I want to really quick talk about why you chose the C major chord for that. Because we have E, G, E, G, A, A, C, B, C, B, C, B. So that, that it's a C and a B, one cool thing you could do is like, all right, well, that's C. If we turn that into a chord, it'd be C major. What you could do in the chord, you could... Yeah, you could. You could. Just, you're right. Because that's kind of like, uh, that's a way you can kind of like add a little bit of that. Uh, yeah, you could play. You, you could do a. Kind of adds a little bit to it. You it know, does. It, it makes it sound more like it. But, uh, but at the same time, the cool thing about transforming a song to another rhythm mm -hmm. is that you get to also change it up, like the structure of it, if you want. For sure. It's your, you're making it your own. So mm -hmm. if I wanted to just stay on something else, like... I could have stayed on that. Yeah. Or I could have you gone do to... do the whole thing just E minor to A minor if you want. Yeah. yeah. No, that doesn't really work. You could just be like E minor. Yeah, I guess you could go to the E7 yeah. too. Yeah, uh, Look, let's let, instead of the C, let's go to the E7 to the E7 with the F, oh, which we also spoke oh, in this video. Yeah. So let's let's do that. All right, three, sorry. four. That sounds kind of cool too. I like that. That like sounds that. even Better more. Actually. But if you want to keep the melody the same as the original, yeah, yeah, yeah. then you would do a C, most Again, likely. Again, it's just about what parts of the song you want to and keep how, and yeah. translate it. And how everyone. flamingo, no, flamenco <laughs> you wanted it to sound. That's how you transform a song. Um, so I mean, just get nylon skills like this madman right here. Do we need to yeah. show another? <laughs> do we need to show another song or? Is, I think that's probably good. It's like probably good. To see how it does, and then each... if you guys like this video, let me know in the comments if you want another song, and we'll show you another yeah. song. Yeah, what challenge us? Choose what your song. song should we Spanish? Taylor by? Swift into Spanish Whatever. guitar, no problem. Great, I love it. Uh, Why well, not? That'll be next. That will be next. Sean Mendes into Spanish guitar. I love it. Let's do it. All right, I'm ready. <laughs> let, let the people let us know. What are we gonna do? It's nice to see you guys. It's nice to be seen. See you guys in the next video. Thanks, Sean Daniel. <laughs>